Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I have right here the new BMW X5 facelift 2024 with the new multimedia system and I want to show you how easy it is to connect your iPhone to this multimedia system wireless. So first of all, what you should do is just go to the Bluetooth on your phone and open the Bluetooth page and on the down part you should find the BMW. But first of all, let me show you also here on the screen. So once you go here to the telephone you can do it from here or actually you can go into the main menu and once you are in the main menu you just go all the way up where is this to Apple CarPlay for example and once you press Apple CarPlay you wait a few seconds until the car will uh, search for your phone and right now you can see Dan's iPhone if you go to Dan's iPhone and then you just wait a second I have to go back here to the my phone just like that BMW you see it already it already sees the BMW right there I want to put it here on the side okay and then you just confirm here and then you just go continuing just like that and then it start to connect it to the dance iPhone and then it will ask me to pair it and then you just pair it like that and then allow and then look at this it's just connected wait a few seconds also i noticed that this multimedia system from bmw has a super fast hardware and processor so that means look how fast it's loading it asks you here if you want to use uh, the, the apple carplay and then just like that boom it's work and you just close the phone leave it on the side and you're connected and the great part is that you can see these all over the screen it will appear all over the, the multimedia and you have 14 inch screen here uh, to play with and it's very responsive incredible responsive you have the map right here this is the map from your phone and you have all the application that you have on your phone you have it right here on your screen as well and they are super useful you have zoom whatsapp spotify telegram plug share wherever cnbc news for example you can read it here and you can see all the information and settings even the charging map if you have an electric bmw you can see it right here anyway now if you want to use siri and voice command from your phone you just go to voice command you press it three seconds navigate to barcelona getting directions to barcelona spain and then right now you can see it's just going there it's just calculating the route you just have to press go and then it's go there it gives Starting you all the information to proceed to Hubelgastris, then turn right cool huh and then you have all that cool screen if you want to see i know many questions yeah we will see it on the screen here the map as well on the cockpit and i will show you right now let me go to the map and the answer is yes you can see your map from apple carplay on your cockpit it's one of the unique car that you are able to do that and this is from my point of view just fabulous but if you want to see the augmented view if you have the augmented view you will you won't be able to see those directions and also if you go to the head of display let me show you let me go to head of display i think you won't be able from what i remember to see the map but let's try it out yes i was right guys no map there on the screen on the head of display so you have it only 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 here on the on the cockpit so this is cool anyway it's cool feature if you want to go back you just go here back just like that and then here you can go and use even the google map you can use it because it has google map up here but keep in mind great features easy to use if you want to go back to the multimedia system of bmw you press this bmw here and you're back in the in the system you're back in the system of the car and you can use all that features without any problem from here as well and of course if you want to go back to android you go to the um, shortcut that it's you can see right now we have an extra shortcut before it was only four shortcuts here now we have an extra shortcuts and this shortcut it's for android so you press it you go to android you want to go back to press bmw just simple as that so that was how simple it is i will probably do a video also with android i need a phone first time and then i will probably do in the future 
um, a video on how to connect your Android phone with this multimedia. But that was the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and I see you soon in the next one. Bye, guys.